obviously. We have a very special segment of the Wild Ass Circus in store for you right now, because uh, if you tuned in last night, you heard Esprit and Todd on the program, a couple of Wild Ass Circus listeners who are in love and they want to get married and they found out that I was an ordained minister through the Universal Life Church of Modesto, California, ULC.org, if you'd like to join me. And uh, they came up for their uh, uh, premarital couples counseling, which we did on the air last night. And Esprit said she in particular wanted to get married on the air. So, uh, hey, we're happy to accommodate. We've, we've, we've done, um, I've got seven or eight weddings under my belt, but this is the first, uh, this will be the second one we've done live, uh, live on the air. The first one we've done since we've been here at Live 105.3. Mm-hmm. So we're, uh, we're breaking some ground here. The, uh, the studio has been appointed accordingly. We have family members in attendance. Everybody's uh, so dressed up. <laughs> everybody looks great. And uh, we have Esprit and, and Todd in the studio as well. So uh, here we go. Uh, without further ado, I'm going to uh, cue the wedding march from Cody, who uh, is sitting behind the pipe organ tonight, doing a lovely job. And uh, we'll have Esprit and Todd approach the microphone here, and uh, we'll get started. It's okay to cry, guys, over there. Uh, you know, it's a wedding, and this is a emotionally moving time. So uh, here we go. Esprit and Todd have uh, stepped up to the microphone, and I will uh, begin officiating. <clears throat> Everybody ready? You guys ready? Okay. Wild Ass Circus listeners, we are uh, gathered around the radio tonight to celebrate the love of Esprit and Todd, who have... Come to the Live 105.3 studios tonight to be joined in a union of marriage. Like the birth of this union being conceived under unlikely circumstances, so can love be found in the most unexpected of venues. Such was the case in the early days of the new millennium when Esprit and Todd met one another when they were both working at PetSmart. Esprit wasn't looking for love but love came looking for her. And within a few months, Todd had proposed marriage. A few months after that, they moved in together, but it would be years before they would find themselves pledging their love for all eternity while streaming on the web at live1053.com. What transpired from then until now is a lifetime all its own. Neither ferret plagues, nor vengeful, thieving lesbians, nor injuries sustained from wrestling in the dark have been able to mount enough resistance to derail the love that has brought Esprit and Todd here tonight. In fact, it was Esprit's wish to be married over the airwaves with all of her fellow Wild Ass Circus listeners listening in, and it was Todd who went along with it in order to give her what she wanted. I'll say this. Todd's off to a good start, showing the spirit of generosity and compromise that will serve him well in his marriage for years to come. I mean that. That's from one old married guy to uh, another. At this time, we'll uh, welcome on our special guest. Spree said that uh, she really wanted to get married live on the air, and she had a couple of uh, people she wanted me to in- invite. Now, I thought it might be a little late for them to make it up to the studio, but I believe we have them uh, phoning in. Wait, look at the look of excitement on Esprit's face. Pugs and Kelly, do we have you guys? Yeah. Hello. Hey, guys. Oh, uh, don't you feel like you're going to disappoint her, Pugs? She's looking for something important. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to let down. No, you should see her face. She's smiling from ear to ear. She didn't think you guys were going to be able to make it in any form or fashion, and I didn't want to build up her hopes. But... Uh, uh, I got you guys to, to phone in. Now, which this is, uh, Kelly was telling me. never even invited us. We'd have come. Okay. Yeah, I just okay. got a call like an hour ago. Okay. <laughs> Pugs would just come because he found out there was going to be cake. We've got a oh, lovely. Is? Yeah. We have that a. Re- jokes. Yeah, we have a reception table set up outside the Pugs and Kelly office. <laughs> Yes. So uh, we'll uh, we'll save you some. Now I don't know if you guys happened to hear our uh, premarital premarital couples counseling that we did on the show last night with Esprit and Todd, but these two have actually been together for quite a long time. I mean, they've been together since the year 2000. Their relationships have made it wow. damn near longer than any of y'all's, right? Yeah, 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so far, Where is yeah. this? We're in 2007? Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, see there, uh, Spree and Todd, you've impressed uh, our midday show, heard, heard weekdays 1030 to 3. Now, guys, uh, you are both veterans of marriages. Uh, at this point in the ceremony, and I, you know, I, I'm not even going to ask if anybody wants to, to uh, ob- object, but uh, I, I figured you guys might be able to offer a little bit of uh, words of wisdom for these newlyweds. Kelly, you got anything? Uh, no, not really. Um, the older you get, the more expensive it is to divorce. <laughs> All right, now. Yeah. Well, I would. Uh, I would like to add uh, both of you. Be sure and pick your battles. Sage advice: pick your battles. That's, That's right. One. That is a good one. Yeah. Pick pick your battles. Would you agree with that one, Kelly? Yeah, totally. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. What about? And it's really important if TV is important to you that you marry someone that TV is not important to. <laughs> yeah, because huh. you don't want to be fighting over shows. Yep. That's one I've never thought to incorporate into my vows up to now. I might make a note of that one for future use. Thank you for that, Kelly. Well, here's what we're going to do, Pugs and Kelly. You just hang on the line there, and uh, I've asked you to gather a handful of rice. Uh, it, it, we're going to throw that up in the air here just momentarily. Okay. But you now, trail mix is that okay? Sure, that's fine. Now we're going to progress to the vows. Are you guys ready? All right, yep. here we go. <clears throat> do you, Todd, promise to love Esprit, to stand by her and do everything within your power? to accommodate her every time she wants your personal milestones to coincide with radio station broadcasts. Oh, yeah, we'll turn the microphone. There we go. Go I do. Good. And do you, Esprit, promise to be loyal to Todd, to reciprocate his selflessness, and to always keep the radio set to Live 105.3 downloading podcasts whenever possible? I do. And do both of you Promise to give each other the benefit of the doubt, making every effort to talk instead of shout. That rhymes. I didn't even realize that when I (laughs) wrote that. Laugh whenever possible, and eventually forgive the fact that I wore thrift store clothes to your wedding when everybody else dressed up. I do. I do. Esprit and Todd, by the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church, And David Henry, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now make out for the Live 105.3 webcam. Congratulations. Fantastic. Congratulations, kids. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Boy, there's every, people are tearing up a little bit here in the studio. All right. Well, Pugs and Kelly, thank you for taking time out of child rearing and television watching to uh, phone in to the wedding. Well, I take, are you going to have pictures of you signing the certificates? You sign the certificate and everything? Oh, yeah, 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 absolutely. We photograph everything, video everything. It'll all be up at live1053.com momentarily so you can watch it online. We didn't even get to congratulate the the happy couple. Yeah, please do. The floor is yours. Spree and Todd, congratulations. Thank you. I wish you all the best. Thank you so much for being on. Well, we'll have to meet you someday soon. Oh, yeah. Like at Blackfin Sunday night. night. (laughs) Oh, you want to go and plug an appearance, uh, Pugs? What are the particulars there? Well, I'll be uh, at Blackfin on Sunday night from 7 to 9 watching football. Or maybe you're an afternoon person who would like to join me Saturday at Fox Sports Bar and Grill. Legacy in the tollway, 2 to 4, for some college football watching. Well, I know Todd wants to do dodgeball, so. Oh, good. A few months away. Okay. You know, uh, some might say, uh, Pugs and Kelly, that you might have cheapened the ceremony just a little bit by plugging appearances. But yeah. that's okay. I think uh, Spree and Todd are adaptable. And to further that point, Spree and Todd, and this is the Wild Ass Circus's surprise for the two of you, we're sending you on a honeymoon to Hyena's Comedy Nightclub this weekend to see J.B. Smoove. Uh, my understanding is Gary's going to set aside the VIP table for you, and you're going to have a, a great time out there. I'm very happy for you guys. I tell you what, uh, we have had couples do the uh, marriages on the air that seemed uh, a whole lot less uh, stable than you guys. And after meeting you last night and uh, seeing how long you've been together and everything, you know what? As a guy who got married under extremely unconventional circumstances and is about to celebrate his third anniversary, doesn't matter how you do it. Just make sure that you do it with the right right person right huh right turley right and if you can't be with the love the one you love what do you do 
You love the, the one, one you're, you're with. with. Thank you, Pugs and Kelly. All right, guys. Thanks very much, and uh, we'll be listening to you tomorrow middays. Okay. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye, All right, thanks. there goes Pugs and Kelly. Middays, you can uh, check them out here on Live 105.3, 1030 to 3. Time for cake yes. and a live spot. Yes. How about that? Okay, congratulations, guys. Thank I'm you. so happy for you. Everybody looks so nice. <laughs> Seriously, you should have told me about the dress. I would I actually own a tuxedo. <laughs> All right.